Merchant shipping is the most important mode of transport to Europe and the rest of the world. In spite of ever-increasing vessel traffic, the number of accidents involving large oil spills has decreased in recent years. However, risks remain. Oil pollution can have a serious effect on marine wildlife and habitats, shipping lanes and beaches. From an economic standpoint, coastal communities, which may depend on industries like fishing, mariculture or tourism, can be devastated. The overall socio-economic cost can run into billions of euros. These serious ecological and financial consequences can be reduced substantially by removing the oil from the sea surface before it washes ashore. Oil pollution in Spain and France after the sinking of the Erika in 1999 and the Prestige in 2002 clearly demonstrated that there were not enough pollution response ships in Europe with the capacity to deal with major oil spills. To help respond to ship-sourced oil pollution, EMSA, the European Maritime Safety Agency, has been given the task of providing extra operational support in this area to EU member states. While the primary responsibility to respond to an oil spill still rests with the affected member state, this extra capacity, provided by EMSA, can make a huge difference to how fast and effectively Europe can react to future oil spills. EMSA has created a network of oil spill response vessels that are strategically positioned around Europe. These vessels can provide, upon request, additional response capacities to top up the national oil pollution response. EMSA's contracted vessels have a higher recovery rate and larger tank capacity than normal governmental oil spill response vessels. EMSA uses contracted vessels which are not dedicated only to oil spill response. This is cost efficient. Ships in the network can carry out other commercial tasks most of the time, but, importantly, are available as soon as they are needed. These commercial vessels all have state-of-the-art equipment for fighting oil pollution at sea. These ships are available to assist all EU and EFTA coastal states to combat oil pollution at sea. These offshore operations help to protect Europe's coast from oil pollution and reduce the costs of impacts. Currently 16 EMSA contracted vessels are spread around European waters, covering the Baltic Sea, North Sea, English Channel, Atlantic Coast, Bay of Biscay, the Mediterranean Sea, Ligurian Sea and the Black Sea. In order to serve as oil spill recovery vessels, all EMSA's contracted ships have undergone appropriate modifications to ensure that specialized oil spill response equipment is installed on board and can be operated safely. The modifications of the vessels are closely monitored by the agency and EMSA officials oversee the progress. Once the modifications are completed, the vessels receive certification from a classification society to serve as oil spill response vessels. Formal acceptance tests assess the capabilities of the vessel and crew for the oil recovery operations. Each vessel has a speed of at least 12 knots and the maneuverability required for carrying out oil spill recovery operations. It is also equipped with a radar-based oil slick detection system, thus allowing oil recovery operations at low visibility and at night. Decanting capabilities increase the onboard storage capacity of recovered oil, and tank heating facilitates offloading of collected oil. EMSA operates an emergency response system, with officers standing by 24 hours a day. A request for assistance in an oil spill emergency is typically routed through the MIC, the European Monitoring and Information Center in Brussels. Upon receipt of a request, the EMSA duty officer immediately contacts the contractor operating the requested vessel. Following a request for assistance, EMSA activates or even pre-mobilizes the vessel to facilitate the operation. The pre-fitted oil recovery equipment will be quickly loaded and installed and the ship sails to the spill site. Each vessel is equipped with two sets of state-of-the-art equipment. The primary oil recovery system is based around the sweeping arm concept with an alternative ocean-going boom and skimmer system also available. 
The requesting member state can select which system to use in accordance with the incident characteristics. Command and control during an incident always rests with the member state using the vessel. Regular oil spill exercises are important for maintaining preparedness to respond to marine pollution incidents. They serve as both training opportunities and as a means to ensure the response system will work well in an emergency. In addition to the quarterly drills that each EMSA ship has to pass, larger and more complex exercises involving several response vessels and support ships from several countries are held each year around Europe and EMSA's ships participate regularly in these exercises. This frequent practice ensures readiness and effectiveness for the response to a real incident. Recent incidents have demonstrated the efficiency of the EMSA network of oil spill response vessels and the effectiveness of their response equipment to combat marine oil pollution. EMSA liaison officers will provide technical advice on site during a pollution incident either on board of the EMSA ship or in the command center of the requesting member state. Oil pollution incidents, like the Erika or Prestige disaster, can strike a devastating blow to marine environments and coastal communities. While we cannot predict when and where the next emergency will occur, EMSA helps member states to be able to boost the resources they have to respond at national level. By making more capacity available, and ensuring rapid response times, we can work together to minimize the harm that oil spills may cause. This is a clear example of how European cooperation can work to the benefit of everyone.